With football right around the corner, ECU fans will be expecting much more from the offense this year. After a season where the Pirates were one of the bottom 10 teams in scoring points, they've changed multiple pieces of their attack. In the coaching staff, they hired John David Baker from Ole Miss as their new offensive coordinator, with Jake Garcia transferring in from Missouri as quarterback. And when you add on the NCAA's rule change to allow coaches to communicate with their quarterbacks via helmet before the snap, this year's offense will undoubtedly look different. It's going to be a, a, a little bit of trial and error for sure. Um, but that's just where, you know, I've, I'm grateful we've gotten to use it every day in practice. We've gotten to use it in our scrimmages. We've got to use it with the 15 second cutoff. So we've we've gotten some test runs at it. The best advice I've gotten is don't talk in his backswing. You know, don't give him too much. Don't make him overthink something. You know, you've spent X amount of hours doing, during the week coaching the guy. Trust that. Trust that training. Don't don't trust. You know, five seconds before he snaps the ball, you telling him something that's going to make the difference. Baker, Garcia, and the Pirates will put that to the test this Saturday when they strap on their helmets for a 6 o'clock kickoff at Downey Ficklin State.